Yo, what's up, guys? <laughs> it's Jesse. Alney. No. I don't know if I've ever explained Almost. the name behind my channel. I'm several videos deep into this thing, and I don't know if I've ever explained it. So first, before I get to that, welcome to this week's video. We are heading to Dubuque, Iowa for a farewell guys weekend for the man who is just singing beautifully in the front seat, Sethers, because Sethers. in about a month and a half-ish, he is moving to New York. And that's where we're gonna leave it because exactly, we're gonna have a little cry. We got Sethers and we got Daniel, Dan Gert. After being absent from all my videos thus far, <laughs> wow, <laughs> that a was a sneeze. Fun. Two weeks in a row now, we got videos with G Dog. Let's get back to what I was saying. I've never, I don't believe, described. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Last interruption. <laughs> the meaning behind my channel's name, it's All Me. My last name is Alney, A-L-N-E. And when people try to pronounce it, 90% of the time they completely butcher it. Aln, Aln, Alney, just really bad. Well, when my dad was uh, growing up, he came up with a saying that said, when people couldn't figure out or, try to, or couldn't remember how to pronounce the last name, he'd say, remember, it's all knee and no foot. And that's that, and that's where it came from. So he told us that when we were young, and I just held on to that for a long time, and I thought, what a perfect name for a channel. It's all me, and remember, it's all me and no foot. So that's where that came from. So now that you have the origin story, let's get on to the rest of this party known as Farewell Guys Weekend. Beautiful piece of abandonment. Oh my gosh. The Edinburgh Manor. A lot of history here for us three fellers. Yep. More so me and Seth, but yeah. a lot of history for our team. One of the most truly deeply haunted places in Iowa. Classic. So this building here, this is again Edinburgh Manor. This used to be a poor farm slash mental institution. And um, this was close to the public for a long time. Now again, this is referencing back when we did ghost hunting. In 2012, we actually had supper with the owners and through discussion and whatnot, we convinced them to open this building to the public for investigations. Since then, it's been featured on probably the biggest ghost hunting show ever, known as Ghost Adventures on the Travel Channel. And we got to be a paramount part of this becoming open to ghost possibilities. Let's go, Friggity Fro, 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 Fro,
We made it to Dave's house. The first initial, initial official stop. Look at Bumpers. He's just waiting. He's so excited. <laughs> okay. All right, I'm gonna get out and see the pups. Oh, Bumpy's already so excited. Hey, Dave. Hi. I can see the excitement on this puppy. <gasps> wild, wild child, huh? Hi. Hi, Dave. Hi. Hi, puppy. That's Hello. Good. Hi, Schmidt. Hi, Schmidt. Oh! You stay down. Stay down. Stay down. No, stay down. Stay down. Stay down. Stay down. Stay. Down. Stay. stay. Oh! <laughs> okay, I'm gonna protect my nuts now. That's Jora. That is a wild, wild puppers. Like but it's a golden, so I'm not surprised. Yeah. Hey, puppers. Except Get away from the nuttles. This is precious cargo. I want, I want, Just put your knee up. I want kids someday. The puppers, they have puppers. 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 Smiley, you smiley. <laughs> I know. Easily jump over that fence. Oh, yeah. You just destroy snags, don't you? We're raiding, we're raiding Dave's fridge right now. We got bangs. Look at the bangs. Oh my, we got, oh, bangs are buried. That's what's up, girl. You want a keto thing? A meltdown. Keto. Thanks, Dave. Oh, and we got coffee warming up. We're finna get lit. Finna get lit. Let's get our meltdown on. Okay, so this keto meltdown peach mango literally tastes like the peach rings candy. What's this door? This is actually, uh, as Dave puts it, the third basement. And the third basement? Yeah. And he's where he says Kelsey it's likes sub -level to. sub-level home. This isn't even the basement. And, yeah, right. Like so, basement. yeah, it's really him just making up bull crap, but it's actually like a two and a half, 2.5 basement. Yeah. And this is where Kelsey keeps the bodies. The bodies? No, careful. Mm. Arms fall out and everything. It's that full. Like, I was startled. Shocked. Seriously? Startled. Yeah. Are you serious? Mm-hmm. Just arms, not full bodies. Oh no, she chops them up. Oh. So that just shows you how many they're down there. He even go downstairs. Why are the arms placed at the door though? Girl, if you go, is the entire further, basement there's... filled with bodies? Yes. Like, I'm sorry, but it who goes organizes to... bodies like that? I don't know. Seriously, that makes no sense. You don't. You don't. Okay. So honestly, I opened it and I looked around, dug a little bit, pocketed a couple things. I was just saying. The arms were the last things that went in, and they're up against so the door. So, was it as was it this disheveled when you first went in, or be because you dug around amongst the arms and the legs that now it's a mess? No, it wasn't stacked per appendage, by say, but there's not like you just go in there and it's a bunch of arms. That's just stupid. Well, like, then let's go in there. No, don't go in there. Why? It's a bloody mess. Oh, oh no, there he he's gonna hear us. <laughs> it's a it's a broom closet full of brooms. I heard everything he said. <laughs> Dave is shirtless, so I need to edit him because this is too too much nipple for the internet. <laughs> Ooh, that Bukakis nipple. <laughs> My throat is on fire now, that's what she said. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> <laughs> no, you liar! You're a liar! No, you're going in. No! I'm spilling! You made me spill! I'm gonna go in now. <laughs> Come on, Dave. My bad, I'm sorry. For the love of all this holy, what is the Wi-Fi, Dave? Yeah, what is the Wi-Fi, Dave? Ow! Yeah. Get off my land. I Whoops. Like <laughs> nice. No, that's not the password. It's cute. Whoa, whoa, what was that side eye all about, hood rat? No, my bald spot gets cold. <laughs> <laughs> your bald spot. What's your name? Yeah, better not 
Dude, I would be so mad. Why are you being rude, foo? Huh? Whoa, hood's coming down. Oh, mine's big. That's what she said. Gross. <laughs> hey, hey, I have it. Oh, I set all this up and you guys are just messing it up already. <laughs> this is all the hard work we just did. All the hard work I just did. They're even upset about it. The dog's downstairs. <laughs> well, here you are. You're hungry. And you're taking a video. Why don't we just eat? Hey. He winked unless you can't see that. So that means he's lying and being fake, which is his persona. Look at the meat and the chips and things. And Kelsey. Hey. It's time to eat. Well, get stuff ready to eat. Yeah. Would be a guy's weekend without lots of meat. Lots of meat. <laughs> In buns. <laughs> buns, he means buns. Yeah, no, buns. buns. Yeah, buns. We're not being inappropriate, no, I promise. Absolutely. Well, really, we, we mean butts. There's gonna be a lot of, a lot of butts. Because people have butts. So there's a lot of butts. <laughs> there's, there's, we do all have butt cheeks. There's gonna be a lot of people yeah. in this house. A lot of people yeah. in this house, so a lot of butts. Right now, currently in this room, 10 sets, or 10 separate butt cheeks <laughs> are about to get spread. Come on. There it is, the finished product, an ish dip, because I don't cuss like Dave, because he's a filthy, <laughs> filthy man. Beautiful. I made that. Yeah, buddy. Thank you, Kelsey. You're welcome. You know, you copyrights and things on YouTube. Five hours later. Where are we? We are at uh, University of Dubuque at their CGIM building. Dave, Dave and I sold our soul here a couple yeah. different times. But hey, we got to go to Italy because of this room. Hey! So it is about a quarter to ten, and we just happened to notice that there was a green light on, it, on the door. And we grabbed the door handle, and it opened. I tried to turn the camera on sooner than this, but it was malfunctioning, so here we go. As we explore this building. This is where the computer labs were. I learned graphic design just by... Computer labs, okay. It's gonna be really dark, so bear with us. That's where I learned graphic design. Okay. Do you see anything? You know, it's it's better than you'd think, but overall it's pretty dark. It'd be really, really granulated. Hold on. You know, I, I do have to say, like... This is where I gave my one of my first speeches on ghost hunting. Really? Yep, right in there. Like when you were still so, here? Your lab. What's that? Like when you still went here? Yeah. Yeah, this is where my speech class was. I think it was in here. Looks right. different now. Nice. Video <laughs> game design room. Learn video game design. Okay. A bit of 3D modeling. 3D modeling and video game. That's great. Here. Nice idea. I'm gonna let it shine. So mom and dad and I went down and got sold on UD by Alan Garfield. And really? Yep, down. Right down, right down there. It's so easy to do. Get there? Yeah. Totally. That's not so bad. Yeah. I, yeah. No kidding. And you're tough. I bet, dude. I remember like this was just yesterday. Just yesterday when you were here, Garrett, when you were still teaching, right? Yeah. Oh, Basic thugonomics. They, they tore down. 101. The yep. tower. That's what Gert. Uh, yeah, oh my gosh, the clock tower's gone. Yeah. yeah. They did there used that. to be a clock tower like, right there. Yeah. Oh Gert used to teach here. He <laughs> taught uh, exactly. basic thugonomics 101. But actually, they're doing one of the top like, teachers uh, in Dubuque. Top three or top five? Ooh, I don't want to boast. Uh, 
Here's your like chance, though. I'll just show you. No, okay. Fine. Yeah. Yeah. But, like, uh, he, he was number one. When I looked at the... Yeah. I'm doing Instagram. Wow, well, that is pretty neat. <laughs> it is pretty neat, man. Whoa, Whoa. hey. That sure is neat right there. You don't see that unless you're out in the wild. <laughs> All right, we Seth, it in. where are we at? And this is where my dorm was my freshman year of college. Yeah. Good memory, Seth? Oh, yeah. Yeah? Good Seth was the only person on his floor that had his own room. Yep. It was I pretty awesome. I never had a roommate until I moved into a house with a guy. <laughs> the party still cracks me up. Yeah, I'm not gonna make that one. I know, everyone thinking that we were uh, a couple. <laughs> Do you blame them though? No. I mean, we look really cute together. Yeah, we did actually. Yeah. Okay, real quick, this is where I was my sophomore year. I was an RA. I lived on the fifth floor, the top floor. And we moved all my junk up all those stairs. But if you would position your eyes down there, there's one less of a floor to go up. But we decided to go up the It's side true, holy all, crap, you're right. All the flights. Wow. They forced us to have enough furniture for two people, so two beds, everything, in a small dorm. Then they told us we couldn't have it. So then they took it away. And then all of a sudden, so you prepped your room, and then in the middle of the semester, they're like, oh no, we gotta put that all back. So you get all this furniture put back in your place. So us and the other RAs formed a plan to figure out the security schedule of them checking the buildings. And right when the security officer left, we took all the furniture from my room and ran it all the way down to the bottom floor and locked it into this storage room. <laughs> Up and forth, I was so out of it, I literally wandered like this onto the fourth floor, thought I was at my room and tried going into somebody's room because I was so <laughs> out of it because we were beat. Holy crap. Insane. No kidding. Yeah. Can't tell. Oh, oh shoot. Yeah. Now we've we've never been in here. No, this is brand new. Brand new facility. No. Are they really? Yeah. Dave really has to take a dump. Bathrooms are locked. Try the locker room, yeah. What's wrong? I don't want someone's pee on someone my butt. peed on the, on the seat, so. So wipe it off. No, that's gross. Dude, you, how bad do you gotta go? Not bad enough. <laughs> Apparently. Man, this is so nice. Yeah, it is. The old place was like so retro. Was it really? Mm-hmm. Dude, I'm all alone out here. I don't have to poop. Even if I did, there's not enough stalls. Oh! Yeah, even guys that Here they come! That was a passing car. Can you see them? Not really. There they are. There's Seth, Dave, and Gert. Hey. Yo. Can I do a shout out real quick? Yeah. Um, there, we, there we go. Yeah, that's good. I just, uh, I just want to do a shout out to... Uh, Tyler Kruger. Tyler um, Kruger, okay. I'm glad he can make it. Yep. This weekend. Yep. It's, uh, it's been great seeing him. Yep. And, uh, oh, wait. No, never mind. He's not here because he doesn't hang out with us anymore. Oh! <laughs> and he wasn't invited. Oh! <laughs> Cap off. Good night, Dave. Good night. Thank you for the blankets and the fan. Sleep well, sweetie. You too, babe. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. <laughs>
what guys' weekends and nights were end with peaceful good nights. Yeah. I'm going to bed at a reasonable time. At uh, 11.27. Chris is going to stay in guard at us in here until 12. Mm-hmm. Shift's over. Yep. Uh, That's I'll how Gert stands at work. Well, say good night, guys. Good night. Good night, you two. Good morning. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Yeah, very cool. Still looks like something we could build from Walmart, but yeah. True. Christian Clem could do this. Oh yeah. yeah. Like I think all they are is just like those like strips or whatever.